Hey there, I'm Eric Stone. I'm CEO of Cognento. And we're a Web2 company that does CRM, very boring stuff, kind of like Salesforce. Well, in 2018, we were one of the first CRMs to start integrating the blockchain into business software. And what did that mean back then? Not much. It wasn't until about 2021 that there was a new, pro not a protocol, a new standard called verifiable credentials. You've heard of digital identity. Well, verifiable credentials are the metadata that hang on your identity. So every time you talk about identity, it really doesn't mean anything without all of that metadata attached. Now, verifiable credentials are a little different than NFTs. NFTs are simply digital assets that you own. Whereas a verifiable credential is a digital asset that you own and verify. Now, there's this little company, you've probably heard of them, they're called Microsoft. Microsoft, believe it or not, has the largest install base of Bitcoin-enabled applications in the world. Hundreds of millions of people have a Bitcoin-enabled application already on their phone. How many of you have Microsoft Authenticator on your phone already? Some of you do, great. Well, if you already have Microsoft Authenticator, open it up, look at, you know, do your face ID thing, and in the bottom right, you'll see verified ID. That literally is Bitcoin and the IPFS network running right there. Wanted to go back, I skipped what we're running here. So this is actually a side tree that runs on Bitcoin and it uses IPFS. And the way the side tree works is anytime that you wanna run the ION network, it starts indexing the entire Bitcoin blockchain, picking up its artifacts off of the IPFS network. And that's how it works. This is what Microsoft has literally replaced Active Directory with. You've all heard of Active Directory. Almost every single person in Microsoft now, Microsoft Land, Microsoft Office, uh, Azure, anytime you log in with Microsoft, you're using a Bitcoin-enabled network with IPFS. Now, would you like to try this? So this is a, a view of Microsoft Intra. This is literally what everybody runs for identity. And this is their verified credential platform. So we're gonna do a demo today and you will be able to get your first verified credential, possibly ever, in your wallet right now. Let's do it. Sorry. Here you go. So if you don't have Microsoft Authenticator, here's the QR codes that will allow you to download that. Now you can go ahead and start that now, but it's going to be a little bit difficult because you actually have to put in your Microsoft ID and do all of your challenges. So if you already have your Microsoft uh, Authenticator, I'll skip ahead to the demo. So if you use this QR code, that's gonna take you to our application. And our application is going to then uh, ask you to authenticate with Microsoft Authenticator, and then you will have a verified credential in your wallet that will look like my card there that you see on the bottom left. It will, it will have my name on it. And uh, that's it, get your first verified credential. This is a look now at the CRM system. And what you'll notice here is you've got all of the metadata around your verified credential. This lets you do all of this with no code at all. You can literally go to Microsoft, set up your verified credentials, come to Cognento CRM, model all of your credentials here, and write them to the Microsoft network, which is powered by IPFS on the ION network. If you haven't done the demo, take a picture quickly, and thank you.